It's day two of the talks here. What's on the agenda of the, the big campaigning organisations now, John? To be honest, the same things. So the big things are saving the Kyoto Protocol, getting a second commitment period um, agreed at this meeting, and linked to that, the start of proper negotiations on a new legally binding treaty for the longer term, which we want done by the end of 2015. So they're still the two big agenda items. The two sides are pretty polarized. So there's the EU and most of the G77 on one side wanting that in slightly different ways, but wanting that. Um, and the US um, and a number of other countries, particularly some of the big developing countries who want the, the new treaty negotiations to be delayed. They want them to go until 2020, which frankly is too late because we need to peak global emissions in a year or two, otherwise it's far too late. Um, so 2020 is a bad date. Uh -huh. And we heard yesterday that Canada, you know, rumours that it uh, might be withdrawing from the Kyoto Protocol entirely in the next few months. Has yeah. there been any developments there? How, how are campaigning organisations responding to that? Um, well, it's not entirely unexpected. So Canada, Japan, Russia have all said that they wouldn't enter a second period of the Kyoto Protocol. Canada has now gone one step further and are saying that they will actually withdraw from the Kyoto Protocol. Um, Canadian NGOs um, think that they'll do it probably a couple of days before Christmas. Avoid a bad press. <laughs> and what about the other issues that we should be looking out for today? Is there anything specific you think is going to come up or is it you know, much the same as yesterday? We're still concerned about closing the, the gap in both in terms of commitments. We're closing big loopholes for land use change and forestry um, and carrying forward so-called assigned amount units from previous periods. Um, and we want to close that down and there's a good set of proposals on both those topics coming out from the Africa group so we're hopeful they'll get some traction. Okay, we'll keep our eyes on that. Thank you very much John. Thank you.